Okay I think I'm gonna review a FUD fantasy card today. Let's see what there is. I just wanna get this off my chest. Y'all are trash. Like y'all are so trash. I want you to know that I'm talking to you. So I'm gonna say your name. Then I'm gonna call you trash. Alexander Isak. You trash. Marcus Lorente. You trash. Alexis Sanchez. Listen to me when I say this. You are trash. I guess there are no good foot fantasy cards in Team 1. Are you sure about that? I need that. We need that. Hello, Bozo. Get it to me! Get it to me! <laughs> Spicy. Oh. Not bad. Oh, wow. Oh. Special. wow, and fuck me. Quite a few times. Fifty times? More. A hundred times? More. Two hundred times? More. Oh, there's just one small problem, and it's a big one. What the fuck? Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking, dreadful, no quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need... You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. You can use the link in the description, use code Magell and get a 6% discount. Alright boys and girls, today is going to be a very, very cheap day, okay? Today we're going to be checking out Delhi Ali's Fantasy Card, lads. And I know on paper this card, you know, it might not sound like the greatest thing in the world, but when you actually look at the in-games, I think this card is an absolute gem. Now, there is one significant problem with this card, lads. You know, like, the stats might be good and all, but this card was a pain in the arse to link up, okay? Getting this guy into a team is your biggest problem by a mile. I was just about able to do it, lads, and honestly, the team that I've built is, like, it's not exactly ideal. There's a couple of things that I'm not particularly happy with. So, yeah, it is possible but it's just incredibly difficult because EA just hasn't really given like the Super League that much love this year. So yeah boys, let's take a look at this team we've put together, okay? I mean, for the most part, I think it's pretty cheeky, you know? We've got Ahmed Musa in here who's from the Super League and of course, you know, you can't really go wrong with a guy like Ahmed Musa. I've got this left back here, lads, that looks like an absolute gem, okay? If this guy was in the Premier League, I've got no doubt that he'd be a really expensive card. But yeah, let's just quickly talk about the cards that are like maybe not so good, okay? We've got this Tonali card that I could technically get someone better here. Like I could even go with like Zambo and Guisa or something like that. But as you guys know, that I'm broke as fuck right now. What? No money? We got Gold Patricio here, which again, not ideal. But to be fair, I actually like Patricio. Like, he's actually a pretty good goalie. And in the right back position, lads, in order to get all these guys on chemistry, I did have to go with this right back here. I'll sub him straight off, you know, as soon as I can. But uh, yeah, I did have to get him, unfortunately. Yeah, that's the team, lads. Again, not exactly ideal. Not the most perfect team you've ever seen. But I don't know. It's not the worst ever. You know, I think it's workable. But yeah, let's take a look at the in games of this Deli Alley Garden, okay? And I'll show you why this card is worth going through the ball lake of putting him in the team. So starting off boys, we've got 6 foot 2, medium, medium work rates, 4 star, 4 star. Now obviously that's a fantastic start. And in terms of the positions lads, you can play this card as a centre mid or a cam. I will be playing him as a centre mid today because I just think this card is perfect for the centre mid position. Like he just feels like he looks to me like a cheap pullet. That might be a little bit exaggerated but I don't know. I just think this card looks fantastic. But yeah, the pace here boys, 85. Of course that's really good especially for centre mid. Maybe not the best for cam but uh, again we're going to be playing him as centre mid anyway. Shooting stats here lads are absolutely incredible okay you got 90 attack positioning 90 finishing there 86 shot power not the craziest long shots but you know i've seen worse passing is all really good here boys you got 90 short passing there 87 vision so yeah the passing stuff is really good dribbling is really great here as well boys you got 90 in-game dribbling 92 ball control 89 composure there not the craziest agility but i think that's pretty good for a center mid now to the defending lads and this is the reason that i do want to play this card as a center mid okay because you know you guys may not be aware that he actually has decent defending most of you guys if you were to play him as a center mid you want to obviously boost that with like a shadow chem style or something but uh, listen I, I like to play dangerously boys okay I want, I want to up the shooting I want to make this card a beast at shooting and in the physical stats lads okay you got 81 jumping which is not bad you got 83 stamina which you know could certainly be better and you got 86 strength which I think is utterly fantastic and as for trades boys you got flare trade and outside of foot trades so some really really nice trades there Cool. All right, then, boys, let's not waste any more time. Okay, let's jump straight into things. Okay, hopefully get some wins today, get some goals, all that good stuff. All right, then, boys, jumping into game number one. Oh, I've completely missed the tackle, for goodness sake. It was so poor, man. I've stuck the leg out, and he just got nowhere near it. Yep, play it. Beautiful pass to Ozzy Murn. He could get the equaliser here. And he has. What a finish, Ozzy Murn. Absolute goat. All right, nice. Boy, Deli Ali. Good. Oh, Deli. Oh, Deli. 
And he's banged it as well. That tripling was fantastic. I don't want to sound weird, but it gives me a boner. Yeah, that too. Lovely. And again, some good football here, boys. Really liking it. Just opening him up. Great ball into one. Oh, I'm going to be dirty here. What the fuck am I doing? That wasn't dirty. That was just stupid. LA using a bit of defending. Oh, and a bit of footwork. You love to see it. Oh, Andy's randomly rage quit. Uh, that, that little turn there was enough to make him quit. And he knew that the Deli Ali penis was coming right up his ass. I don't know why I say things like that. Yeah, good start there, boys. Good little debut for Deli Ali. Get himself a goal there. And uh, yeah, a win's a win. So I'll definitely take that. Good tackle. Love that. Good boy, Deli Ali in the middle of the park. Might go for a Travella here, boys. I'm feeling a Travella. Yeah, fuck it. Oh my goodness me, that was nearly the most beautiful goal. Nice, good boy Della. Oh, do you know what, fuck it, round two. Oh, right, these long shots are mental. Why would you quit at nil fucking nil? I didn't even score those long shots. Honestly, man, the amount of fucking time wasters you play in this freaking game is ridiculous. Like, if they're not winning, like, 8-0, they will just quit and waste your fucking time. It does my head in. I'm so sick of these people, you know? Oh! Now I've got to do a depressed clean sheet dance because I didn't score a goal and I'm, I'm not happy about it. Something's in my ass. <laughs> Lovely. That two. Yo, Deli, make the run. That's not Deli Alley. It's Ozzyman. And oh, that's such a well hit volley, boys. I love that finish. Oh, shit. Now, where, the, where did that pass come from? Well, this is bad. Oh, thank God for that. He fucked it up. Thank God. Ah, come on, come on. No. Oh, it's 1-0, -oh, isn't it? It's 1-0. -oh. That, was, that was a pretty nice goal. I can't really discredit that. Oh, yeah, play Kenny. Lovely. Inside. Oh, Deli with the footwork. Oh, I think there's a goal coming here, boys. Ref, that is a pen. Thank God, that the dribbling, man. The dribbling on Delhi Alley is ridiculous. You, like, they couldn't tackle him there. Right, Delhi, this is your opportunity to get on the score sheet again. I'm gonna do something a little cheeky here, boys. Oh, that's I, I feel bad for that. You dirty, disgusting man! Stop it. Shit, that's a good first touch. He's missed it. Oh, I thought that was a guaranteed goal. For fuck's sake, man! He, he just constantly plays him through. Good save. I'm getting away with it at the minute. This guy is pretty good. And there's no fucking way he's played that through pass again. Oh, that lad, honestly, this guy's had a good, like, three or four chances that he should have scored. Alright, well, I was saying that he probably deserved a goal, and he's finally got it. I am fearing for my butthole, because this guy's been dominating me the last 20 minutes. Goodness me, my defence feels so open. The bloody 4-4-2 with the two CEMs. I'm, I'm not playing it at the minute. I'm playing the 4 one 2 one 2 and I missed the 4 4 2. Oh my god, he's missed again. He can't keep getting away with it. He can't keep getting away with it. That two. Lovely. This is better. Oh, and it through. Come on, what a chance. Aussie. Aussie Moon. Great finish, lad. Oh, and he randomly decided to quit there. Like, what? what What's wrong with this guy? This is the weirdest rage quit of them all because this guy was probably playing better than me in that game. He had a ridiculous amount of chances. I'm, I'm guessing that's why he quit. Is he just got pissed off? But had he stayed in there, like he could have ended up beating me, honestly, like with the amount of chances he was creating. So that for him to quit three two is very odd. But you know what, lads? I'll take it. Okay, we got ourselves a cheeky little rage quit dance here, yeah? so I can't really complain, can I? <laughs> No. All right. Well, that's not a bloody good start to this game, lads. That is not what we want to see. Four minutes in, already one nil down. Don't like that. Nice. And a bet two. Oh, it's lovely. Good, good play there, boys. Delhi, give it a run. Yep. It's a great ball. Swing it. Is he onside? Oh, he is onside. I had a feeling he might be offside there, but thankfully he was onside. Oh, please don't score on me. 
I can't do it anymore. I can't do it anymore. Oh, for fuck's sake, what am I bloody doing in that position? Slide. Oh, what a tackle. I don't think it's going to be enough, though, because he's still got it. Stop it, Alawarian. Oh, it's going to be free one, isn't it? No! Oh, come on, man. He even saved it. All right, come on. That's better. That's good play there, boys. And then through. Come on. And then R9. Me yes, over the top. Please, Ozzy. Not Ozzy Moon. R9. He's still got it. Calm. I'm panicking. Yep. Into Delhi. Delhi finesse. That was nearly sick. Oh, over the top. Please, Ahmed Musa. I'm pretty sure he's on side. Great first touch. No! Oh, man, this guy is quite a... He is pretty good, man. I think he's got me beat here. I doubt I'm coming back into it at 4-1. I'll try, obviously, but it, it's obviously not likely. Where course, he's made a good... Oh, and then he comes out of fucking nowhere and does a slide. I don't even see him! Again, and play it. Great ball into where course. Come on, where course. You can get me back into this if you like. Not with that footwork. You can't. You're not getting anyone back in anything with that footwork. And it through. Please. Good boy. He's, yep, he's fine. No. Come on, Deli. Give me the run, lad. Play him. Great ball. And back to... Oh, way course. You are fucking shy at the minute. Useless. Me with my pregnancy, I'm better than you. And that's the end of that game, lads. I was utterly dominated in that match. I, I've hardly had a fucking chance. And I, that guy just destroyed me. But you know what, lads? Sometimes it happens. You know, sometimes you play a guy who's just genuinely good. That guy clearly was well out of my league. He just, uh, again, utterly destroyed me. So I, I barely got a chance to even, like, show off Deli Alley and stuff. It was just utterly humiliating. But yeah, I'll jump into one more game, lads. Hopefully, we can get back to winning ways. Okay, hopefully, I can show Deli Alley a little bit more. Because so far, I haven't really seen too much. I've seen some good glimpses. But I want to see a little bit more from him. All right, boys, jumping into game number five. All right, nice, Deli. Yeah, back two. Nice. If we pull it there, I can, could fuck him up, you know, with a bit of dribbling. Show him who the real Hullet is, because we all know Deli Ali's better than Hullet. Yes, boys, that is absolutely outrageous. Please, oh, ho, ho, Deli Ali. Okay, we need hold the fuck. Okay, hold on. What the fuck? Hold up. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Oh, okay, excuse me. That is what I'm talking about, boys. We've seen glimpses of how good this car. Wait, what, what's wrong with his hair? His hair doesn't make any sense. Like in game, he's got fucking dreadlocks. Like, look. Yeah, back to what I was saying, boys. Like, he's shown glimpses so far that he can do crazy shit like that. But you know, I really want to see it more. And we've just seen it. That was that was a phenomenal goal. I better not concede here on my speed. I literally, I had to fucking concede, didn't I? Over the top. And then headed down. Brilliant play. Oh, oh nine. That's poor from you. Oh, fuck, I'm getting skinned by Zebio. Oh, I've got a bad feeling here, boys. He's done a good pass. Good block. Hit it. No, Delhi. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, really? So friggin' avoidable, man. I just couldn't head it out. Nice, Deli. Oh, oh, yes. Yes. Come on, Deli. That's brilliant. And an R9. No, come on. That was so good. Oh, yes. Yes. Play Deli. That's not Deli. That's Musa! I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. I was trying to get it to Deli Ali because he was in the best position out of everybody, but it, it went to Musa and he put it in. I, I, so I'm not complaining. Oh, shit, Uzebio. Oh, not even just Uzebio. Everybody was free there. Yes. Ahmed. Oh, what a finish, Ahmed Musa! Blasted into that top corner near post. Brilliantly struck. Right, come on, boys. Let's not concede now, okay? Because I, I keep scoring and I keep equalising, but it doesn't mean nothing if I keep conceding straight after. So, you know, keep it good at the back and then we can maybe try and get a winner. Lovely. One. It's a good chance. Oh, shit. Look at Musa. What a ball. Ahmed. Oh, please. Oh, no, he's missed it. I thought it went in. I was getting cocky. All right, good pass. Play. Oh, wow, Jay, but what a run off the bench. Oh, wow, Jay, for you saucy geezer. Right, we've got seven minutes, boys. Do not fucking lose now. We do not bottle this. No, 
no, no, no, no, no. I might have to go for a cheeky tactical foul here, lads. I'm not liking this. I can't get near him for the tactical foul, though, and I can't tactically foul him in the box. What a block. Get it out. Come on, boys. Head it. That's not a header. Oh, God. What the hell is happening? Side. Just blew the whistle, yay. Head it. Get blow. Oh my god, I thought he'd never blow that bloody whistle. What a win that is, lads. Oh my god, I don't know how we won that. But it's like I always say, boys, it doesn't matter how you win as long as you win. And we'll definitely take a dub there. Four gold dance, a brilliant way to end the episode. Catch a throat fall from the fire vocal. Ash and molten glass like I am John Lotoko. Alright then, boys and girls, let's talk about this Deli Alley card. Overall, I really don't know how to feel about this one. Like, I'm a little bit mixed on him. But, like, don't get me wrong, lads, this is not a bad card by any means, okay? I'm not about to sit here and tell you that I did not enjoy this card. I enjoyed lots about this card okay he had glimpses of genuine greatness i mean just take a look at this goal for a second boys and girls this is like pretty early into this game i'm pretty sure i can't remember it's i mean it's the fifth freaking minute look at the state of this he's dribbling past hullet which you know i mean it's hullet and then he pulls that out i mean look at that but i'm not gonna lie to you lads i didn't really see him that much throughout that game after that you know i thought you know he scored that in the fifth minute what the hell is he gonna be able to pull out the bag after and i honestly didn't really see too much from him after that And that's kind of how it went with like all of the games you know he'd have that like one or two great moments and then I just really wouldn't see him too often. When I could get him on the ball I liked everything I saw lads. His, fo his footwork and, and dribbling was utterly brilliant like he was, he was amazing on the ball. See I'm a tad disappointed with Deli Ali boys. I thought he was going to be a bit better than he was. Uh, he's, he certainly has moments in him when he can really deliver but I don't know I just didn't get involved as much as I wanted him to. So yeah boys let's run a pretty cheeky meter okay. I'm going to give this card a 7 out of 10 and again that might seem harsh considering like some of the goals he did score in his episode were quite outrageous and again he did have those outrageous moments but that's just what it was. It was moments. It wasn't constant brilliance. It was just moments, okay? And if he could have done that more often, I would have easily given this card like a 9 or a 10 out of 10. But yeah, I'm going to record it there, boys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, smash a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right? Peace.